static ones are there all the time. And uh, they count towards the player, the, the zombie maximum. And so uh, if you define a lot of them as static, the server starts running into problems where there's nobody, there's no Zeds spawning in at the dynamic or the static zones. Yeah. Oh, she nearly escaped the zombie. Oh, damn. Did you get me? Somehow my stream is not coming up. <laughs> I was going to say, you're not streaming. I thought maybe that was intentional. Just wait a minute. Shit. I got to get out. I can't change Streamlabs unless I log out. Fuck. Let me see if I can. <clears throat> Game. Game capture. Later, if we go Super north now. to the where I have the barrel I found, you're going to want to get off stream because I I have a high suspicion that uh, the reason that crate we had went missing yeah. is because somebody was watching the stream and went and grabbed it. Even though I wasn't the one streaming, they knew there was a crate somewhere in Dubrovka. And, I mean, that's just the meta. There's not much you can do about that. The only thing you can do is what Reverend used to always do, which is they would always hide the stream uh, when they were within a kilometer of where they had to be. Well, that's what you should do. Oh, shit. I just realized apparently I'm soaked probably because of... Uh, yeah, I got I to gotta dry off because I just got a cold. I'm damp. I'm not soaked. Wet. Oh, the bag is wet. Hell, that. Okay. That bag is on my shoulder. Everything else is damp. Oh, I don't know fuck why I'm wet either because I don't show anything wet. Well, scroll over it. It might be your bag. That's what I just found. And it's not even my bag. It's my shoulder bag. I have a bag, and then I have a shoulder bag, and it's my shoulder bag that's wet. And that's like saying I'm gonna catch the flu because. My, my purse. You know, if I was a woman, my purse is wet. I'm like the hell. So I'm just gonna have to eat a lot of food. And Doesn't hope say that my bag's wet. Do you have a shoulder bag though? Look, look at one of your, look at your slot. That's normally the. Uh, and again, this is something that you can do. If you find some shoulder bags, you can put them on the slot that's your armband slot. Mm. That's the only one that I had that's wet. I just took oh, it off and my wet face mask. Uh, yeah, that you can at least dry out, I think. There's nothing I can do about this mat. Yeah, I can't do that to my bag. I'm going to have to have to just deal with this. Okay, let's see if I can find some water here in town. I'm trying to remember where the... Pick up an alarm clock. The accidentally. And it just disappeared. I logged in and I was laying on the ground. Yeah, that's a new thing they're doing now. You wake up and your eyes are closed too. Yeah. I like it, but at the same time, it's. I've had it just sit there like that. <sighs> are you up in Novo then, uh, Ra uh, Reaper? Turovo. Uh, Turovo. Well, did you want to come here, or did you want to me to uh, come down to the road and meet you? Or are you hauling stuff that you want to stash? Oh, I'm on my way. 
I'm in. I had to stop to get some water here in Mista, so I had to clear some zeds. But um, um, I mean, in terms of storing stuff, I've got nothing to store. I mean, I've got stuff to store, but nowhere to put it. If that makes any sense. What we can do is try to go up towards uh, the Krabby Patty or whatever it's called, the Crab Shack, yeah, yeah. Um, and see if that train is there. And even if it's not, we'll probably find uh, some stashed. Um, oh, shit, I forgot. There's snakes in here. Yeah. Do you have uh, anti-venom? Yeah, yeah. You'll be fine. Trust me. I need to post that video where I spawned in on my server. I spawned in like 20 of them and... I killed all of them with a with a steak knife, and and punched them out as well. I have to boil this pot now because I'm sick and I drank from it. Was Strucky going to jump on CHF or is he uh, not wanting to do that unless we're up north? Well, if he has to spawn in, he'll be near a Reaper. Yeah. Is he used to playing Hardcore Survival? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. He's done this before. Okay, I wasn't certain. He's in the stream, but I, th I don't know what he's doing right now. He's well, he was, in your, he was in your stream earlier, and he said he was going to play. Yeah, yeah. And so I wasn't certain, like, if he's done CHF before. I know he does a lot of PvP, so it's... This is, I mean, the main, it's like I was telling uh, Gin, a Reaper just now, uh, you want to, it's all about low and slow on here. Low and slow. Yeah, it's like making barbecue. That's what I do. Low and slow on the barbecue. Yeah. The uh, hell? A zombie hit me once, and my sunglasses went from being worn to being badly damaged. Give me one damn time. That's the way my luck works. Well... Um, oh, shit. Now I told Strucky in a chat to log in and try and get to Tarovo or meet Reaper in Tarovo somewhere and then head for the Sanaya Poliana to the old pub. And then we'd try and make our way up there to, to see him. Huh? But that might take a couple of days. Nah. Oh, I got some charcoal from the barbecue. So the fire, em, empty fires are given charcoal. Hmm. Oh, that's good. The ones you wake up next to. Yeah. So you had one of those when you woke up? I just no, I just had a fire, and oh, the fire okay. went out. So when you when you spawn in now as a new character, yeah, you have a fire next to you. Oh, I and I wondered, I wondered, oh, I I wondered I if see a fire next to me. Yeah. 
You do as a new character, but I wondered maybe because this was the first time you were logging in since that change, maybe that did that for you. I, oh. I thought that's what you were saying. So I guess they made it that, you know, if you're a player on the server, it's a wipe, but you they don't wipe the character. They just wipe everything else. What do you mean? When they did the wipe, it wasn't player. It wasn't the character and the map. Oh, no, they, they did the, the whole thing. No, they did the whole thing. It was a well, total well, wipe. Yeah, but then uh, why did I wake up here as a character? Oh, okay. So we we. I mean, it's been about a month since we played on here, right? Or since you played on here? At least. But yeah. yeah. Um. Hold on a second. Let me get dressed real quick and get out of here before somebody shows up and even the zombie show kills me. I have a bit of a situation. I tried to head uh, shot a uh, zombie with my crossbow, and it ended up glitching on the um, bush next to him or something. I don't know what will happen, but it ended up not mattering because the zombie apparently decided that it got his attention and he took off following the bolt in whatever direction it went. But I need to get out of here before either a player or a zombie show up. Um, so answer your question. The last time we played was probably end of June, beginning of July. Um, and that was about a month or two after the wipe. Okay. So the okay. wipe, I forget when the wipe was, but it was with 1.25, yeah. uh, whenever that released. And, uh, that was when they wiped the server. We played since then. Um, right. So then why did all the stuff disappear? Well, the stuff disappeared because that was, that was before the wipe. No, when I logged out here, we had all kinds of shit. No, no, that's no way. We we had just made it down there last time we played with Minnow and you, uh, and and Joe even. Joe was with us the last time we played. Um, so you, you're, I think you're thinking back to the small cave uh, that's further away, and um, that's where we had like uh, a rack. All those items that we got from um, when we went with um, with Nomad, mm -hmm. remember when we traveled with Nomad to that base? Yeah, we got all that stuff there. We haven't found anything this season. I found a barrel, and that's up far up north. It would take weeks to get down here without a car. Um, so it, unless Minnow found something and it's in his his person. Like maybe he found a storage kit of some kind. Uh, we didn't deploy anything in there because we didn't have a way to lock it up. Um, the other cave is so well hidden. Um, I only know about it because I've, I mean, I've been on it on other servers. Um, if anything, it's one of the caves I've added to my own server. Um, it's like a collection of 12 caves. I've added all 12 to my server. Right. But um, yeah. Most most of the custom areas on here now, I think, are John's, but a lot of them are mods, and so you can see some of this stuff on other servers. And that cave is one of them. Um, but it's so well hidden that very few people know it exists. Right. Uh, and the wipe happened, like, what, two weeks after we moved in, so we just never secured it. Yeah. But here, I mean, we just haven't played. Yeah. I mean, if you think about it, we were supposed to play last Wednesday... And somehow didn't. And the Wednesday before that, um, Minnow was going to play with us, but he just, he was AFK until like maybe 10 o'clock at night after we had shifted to Red Tick um, and joined us. So it just, we haven't been on Red, we haven't been on CHF in a while. I have. I've been on here, you know, pretty much every other day. Um, but as a group, it had been a while. So. So I think it's just been long enough to where your uh, um, thinking about rewipe. Yeah, Strucky's going to join Discord in a few minutes. Okay. He's uh, loading the mods now. He doesn't remember if he has a character or not. Okay. Uh, if so, it's been a while, it's so, probably been a wipe. Yeah, so, so he'll where be. Where are you there. now? I'm in Staroya, so I'm getting close. I mean, I'm just on the other side of Staroya. I'm gonna. I still have to go through town. And um, 
I'm going to try to eat some food here to bump up my uh, immunity. My, I'm sick, so I got I to gotta get healthy. And the only way to do it right now without medicine is to gorge myself with food. Yeah. Um, and I have no food left, so we have to go fishing. I suspect they're going to change that in 1.26. We'll see. What, they're not going to make it as tough? No, no. They're, so Mark said in his video that they're changing the way that all the medicine works in Daisy. So everything we've known for the last five years, which only changed about, what, a year ago, is going to change again. Now, how much of it? I don't know. Maybe maybe they only change a portion of it. I don't uh, We'll see. But a lot of it's apparently changing for all the new survival mechanics. Like, there's apparently, like, new medicines and stuff to take. Uh, and I don't... See, sometimes these content creators, they create these videos, and the words they choose just aren't the best. So maybe he's referring to just all the new sicknesses. Like, you have, like, heavy metal poisoning. Mm -hmm. Maybe maybe influenza won't change but i just don't i wish people would use more precise language yeah yeah look we ran into this problem with uh, flight simulator with uh there was an add-on called uh flight simulator uh maverick which is like a add-on that adds mm -hmm. all these really cool things from the top gun maverick movie and apparently that was a limited time deal Anybody that snagged it gets to keep it. Anybody that didn't, doesn't. Um, but people have been asking, if I bought it, but I reinstall my computer, do I lose it? And the developer said something like, well, if you bought it, you own it. I'm like, well, that doesn't answer the question. The question was, I get that I own it, but it won't be available on the download store. They've been very clear about that. And so no one really knows what the hell is going to happen. Okay, I got. I had to get out because I got to go to the washroom. Um, I'll be a few minutes, and then I'll be back. I didn't want to leave my character standing there. But I'll be back in a minute. Okay. Did you hear me?
You guys okay? Yeah, yeah. Reaper. Turn Reaper up a bit. These volumes are all around 108%, but sometimes they're not so great. Am I loud and clear? Yeah. yeah, I can hear you. Okay, I'm going to log back in. Are you close by or what? I'm making my way down the hill. i got to be careful because it's this is a really steep hill and I can break a leg. And there's a big barn but yeah, I'm, there. I'm... Don't bring any friends with you. Uh, I think I'm on the wrong track. I need to go south. Boy. I'm trying to find something to open this food. If you find a big black rock, see if that works, because apparently there was something that changed. I just found a floating stone. <laughs> Well, if you can open on a rock, they probably have it set so you lose like 50%. Yeah, you Ooh. may lose 50, you may lose 25. Did you check the barn on top of the hill? Oh, yeah, yeah. That was a while ago. I'm, I'm, I'm almost to the cave. I'm at the very, I'm at the mouth of the, of the ravine. Okay, I, I've got, oh, I've got one rock on me. And I've got six bones. Let's see what else have I got. How the hell am I wet? Everything on me is wet. Sweat. I haven't gotten wet. I don't understand. I'm confused. Anything i got to be worried about? Cutting up a chicken and... It. Is it raining for you guys? Uh, as long no. as your hands aren't bloody. No, the sun's out, though. I know, but I've had this happen before. When Joe and I were on one day, um, it we're gonna get a couple was, more sticks. It oh, was wet. raining, but it wasn't raining. It's like the server was messed up. All everything on me is wet. I've got the west symbol, but. Yeah, uh, this has happened before. It's like the weather changes and it's raining on the server, but nobody notices. And because nobody notices, everybody starts getting soaked. I wonder I'm if they've got some, some kind of like new mod on here where you Do sweat. You have any paper or bark? Um, no, no. I mean, I might have a piece of paper. Hold on. Okay. Uh, if you can, I got some sticks looking, and no, a couple no. pieces of firewood, so I'm coming with it. No paper. Okay. I got matches though, so just twelve of them. Though. I got three left. Can you still make a real kit? <laughs> Here's some sticks. I'm gonna get the rest. Jesus. Oh, you can find bark. Yeah, that you can do. But let me, let me, uh, you don't even have to do that. Do you have any bones? I have a bone, yeah. I just make a knife. Let me check and see if I have a knife on me just a minute. Oh, actually, here, I'll go get us, I'll go get us some bark. 
I got a. I, I've got. I've actually got a stone knife. Paper down. I, don't know, I found some. Uh, no, no, no. I was. I, I went to get. Uh, the bar. It's right here behind you. I used your old fireplace. Okay. Let me get my matches. Keep the matches in waterproof container. I'm wondering if they put a mod on here that causes survivors to sweat, and that's how we're getting wet. Oh no! But. Sick. I would think by now people would have started talking about it because the night that Joe and I kept getting soaked, like soaked, drenched, like within, there's no way that that was sweat because we were getting soaked within. The fireplace for some oh, really? Weird. The night that Joe and I were getting soaked, it was, there was no way that it was sweat because within, um, within a minute, you know, of being outside, we were soaked. I'm like, it's raining on the server. And I re-logged, and it was raining. Uh, but then it stopped raining, and we were still getting wet. But then I never saw that problem again. Like, it went away. So I just assumed it was a fluke. So okay. I don't know what's going on out there right now, but... So what's the plan? You want to get dried out here? Uh, yeah. Okay, get my, dried my, out. My, my, my gloves are wet. Let's get dried out. Let's get a bit of food. This From, oh, so my gloves got wet from taking down no. some trees or... No, nah, I think you're wet for the same reasons I did. I think I think there's something bugged on the server. I think it's getting... I think it's raining, but nobody's nobody sees the rain. Like I said, this happened a month ago, and I doubt it's, I doubt it's what I'm saying, which is a mod that's making us sweat, uh, because... Now my shoes one, are badly I'm damaged. They're wellies. But okay, I do yeah, have I'll, a bunch of rags. If I I'm need gonna to. give you, well, if it's raining out there, your shoes are gonna, the rags are gonna fall off all the time. And I, I know, I know what I say is it is if it's raining. I mean, it, I think it's raining out there. I think that's what's happening, because um, that's what happened. Before. Yeah, it's raining on. My, I can see it on my screen. If you guys relog, we'll probably show it. Uh, that's what I'm thinking. But this is the only server I've ever seen that happen. Desync of weather. Well, they have so many mods and so many special areas. Yeah. It's well, like, and I, I wouldn't surprised, be surprised but, but with then, all the complaints that he was getting about the rain if Crimson didn't write a mod to do the weather and there's something weird about it. Yeah. But let me... I'm going to relog and I'm going to see. Okay. I'm going I'm to relog right here. I'm going gonna, gonna to record. I can't ignite this fire. Is the matches wet? It's definitely not raining now. No, it's a drill kit. Oh, it Why, takes it it just about three a long and a half time? minutes. Does it really? Yeah. yeah. Well, it's 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 like ninety seconds. It's, Is it? Oh, they changed it because it used to be like three and a half minutes. Yeah. It's actually a, a, a third party mod by by some Russian dude. He made, he most of those like find bark, create rags, disinfect rags. They're all his mods. As I I put them on my server as well. For my you know my single player standalone server I play on myself. You should try to make your own little stalker mod. I'd play that shit. I've been wanting to get into Daisy modding for a while. I just haven't had time to really dive into it. Oh, it started. My idea is if you don't want to use other people's mods or have to pay for like a package, is maybe figuring out a way to make just like all the wildlife that's in Daisy, like mutated and aggro onto humans. Yeah. So it's like you know, boars will act like wolves. Like this, this, this new mod yeah, where you know. every time you log in, you're sleeping. Yeah, it's raining it's outside. Cool. Red Holloman found a rover on Namalsk. Hey, Red, is it yep. raining for you outside? Go look outside real quick. Yeah. Uh, uh, no, it's sunny out. No, it's raining for me, and it's raining for Strucky as well. Uh, I'll mention it to John. That's that's oh, why I was soaked. It's a sun shower. That's what it is. Um, yeah, my, my character is wet, wet. Oh, yeah. Oh, so dry out a bit. Yeah, let me put all this stuff on the ground here.
I re-logging red so that you can see the weather. Yeah. Just go out here and... Uh... Yeah, it's definitely raining. I see it now. It was not raining before I re-logged. Go, go outside and stand there so that, near the door so that you can see the difference when you log back in. Yeah, just a sec. I'm doing a message. Yeah, yeah, all good. Yeah, like my pouch is soaked. On dry again. <laughs> okay, you have a DM on Discord. Okay, you want me to relog? Yeah. Go outside. You see how it's sunny? Yeah. Look up at the sky. Yeah. Do you see rain? Look up at the sky. Yeah, I see rain. It's coming down on me. Oh, it is. Okay, well, now, you, maybe when I relogged, something happened and you got synced, but it wasn't... I was getting soaked earlier. It wasn't raining. I logged out, and when I logged back in, it was raining. Oh. And Strucky confirmed that it was raining for him up in the north, and the weather on Day Z, it, if it's raining up in the north, it's raining here, too. Are you streaming, With. Reaper? Why don't you stream, dude? Nah, because I don't know how long it'll be on. I gotta work in the morning. Oh, okay. Uh, you still gotta wait till 60 to eat. Yeah. Three. Yeah. We're we're gonna leave here soon, and we're going. What are we doing? Are we heading for the the pub? We can. Yep. I think we should try and get some. I mean, we can loot up there and do stuff, but. I think we should make a, an organized effort to have a, a goal. It's not going to be permanent, right? It's just going to be a temporary little layover. It's going to be a... Oh, that's... That carrier you got there, you can put a a machete in it too. I just see that now. Wow. What's that? That uh, the thing for your weapon sling. You've got uh, you've yeah. got the pickaxe and you've got the other thing in it. Yep. There's a slot for something called a scabbard, which you have yeah. to find. And when you find the scabbard, you can put a machete or a, or a sword. Oh. If you find a sword, if you're lucky. How the hell did my pristine fishing rod become damaged? I swear, I, Zed hits me one time. That's the only, I've only been hit once tonight. But that one Zed that damaged my glasses, ruined my, um, my enduro helmet, and apparently damaged my. I've got two hatchets, rod. by the way. Okay, this is not drying over here. Are you making out, Strucky? Uh, looking for more food for now. Um. If you get a chicken, then you can make uh, hooks and a knife. There's so many things you have to think of and be ready for in this thing. Here, try to put, um, do you have a slot for, for some shoes? Oh, no. Okay, we'll wait till your shoes become ruined, but once they do, let me know. We'll, yeah. we'll get you accommodated. Because if it continues to rain out there, you can't walk around with improvised footwear that falls off in the rain. Oh, yeah. So now that there is, like, AI and shit, you could have, like, factions in your own PV survival server. No. I've, I've wondered yeah, if they'll ever put AI, AI on here, but they ha that mod they have with the zombies is pretty intense in terms of, uh, like, server resources. So I think... Yeah, they wouldn't be able to put AI on in here. It would be cool, though. 
Or yeah, and if, or if you didn't want mutants, you just get like some crazy zombies, like the ones from 28 Days Later. Like the odd zombies, like maybe in danger, like in high loot areas, there's zombies yeah. that can jump and leap at you. Well, they had jumping zombies on here for a while, but it was it ran off pretty much everybody because there was just <laughs> no way getting away from them because they yeah. all run. Um, and that mod that makes them look all diseased yeah. just makes them like really a lot harder. Plus, an Eddie AI, it makes them sm smarter, and you just you literally couldn't escape. I remember the week that he turned that on with the jumping. I mean, just people just dying left and right, sort of <laughs> yeah. started to empty out. Sure. It was it was a it was a line too far. That's what it's like on the mouse. They're they're jumping up on the trucks and killing you. <laughs> I died. Well, that was probably just. A but truck. I mean, like a leap attack, right? Like yeah. zombies that can like lunge up at you. Yeah. Now, these guys were jumping on top of. If you were on top of a shed, they'd come up with you. So well, I was on top oh, yeah, of the truck, climbing, and they so. all got up on the truck and beat the hell out of me, and then I died. That was hey, one of my lives. My God, it took so many tries to get this fire lit. I'm gonna take. Well, we get. We want to. We don't want. We don't want to go out while it's raining because we'll just have to take another right. break in ten minutes to dry off again. Okay, I'm gonna lay down too. Yeah, lay down. Um, keep an eye out. I gotta. I gotta go grab something. I need some water. Well, I'll try to hear, but I'm. I can't see when I'm sleeping. Yeah, well, I understand. If you want to, we can take turns. It's still oh, raining out there. We I need can't to stay sleep until it stops. Anyway, I'm seventy-five percent. Yeah, well, you, you 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 keep an eye out. I'm gonna go grab something. I'm AFK, okay. and um, when the rain stops, we can go. But I don't think it's a good idea to travel in the rain. We'll be getting sick. All right. You left a saddlebag here on the ground. Might be a battle for the chicken and Novo. <laughs> I hear, I hear uh, our rooster, sorry. I don't to kill it. Oh, yeah, try and get it. But rip uh, rip some rags as you go, man, because you're going to need like 10, 12 rags so you can carry a gun. Yeah. Then you can go back and get the carbine. That reminds me, how many bullets, what bullets have I got? Let's see. I've got... Oh, I don't have any bullets. Shit. No ammo. But I do have a battery for my radio. And it's in pretty good shape. I think CHF, the way it is set up, I think it would be perfect on uh, Alteria. Because that... that that ma that map's even like more dull and like gloomy looking than Chinaris. Yeah, it's not put together the same. I, I don't think the graphics and everything is. Oh no! I look. I no. I think it looks really good. Everything looks plastic. The Daisy map here looks real. You know what I mean? When you look at the hills, they look like big blobs that were sculpted out of paper mache and painted. I've seen, I've seen it. Maybe it's just my, it is just my opinion, but some people will tell you. Well, I'm just a fan of like new buildings and stuff. Yeah. is kind of far. Remember, you want to avoid the Zeds as much as you can. Yeah. They're nasty. Unless you got something to take them out with. I just box them.
Move the fish. We're sitting. We're sitting ducks here. Okay. Getting okay. dark. Is it? You getting dark, you said? Or I'm at, I can barely see. All right. I found a taser with ammo. Oh, that's good. You found a taser? Yeah. I have the battery. You want this what? bag? Is this a bag on the ground here? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm grabbing it. I'm grabbing it. Yeah, this has a battery in it. I think it has one or two shots. Too bad we couldn't put the fire out and take it with us. <laughs> well, we can with a torch, but then when somebody's got to hold a torch. And we don't have enough rags, honestly. Well, I got honestly, enough rags, but I'm saving them in case I need to make shoes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I've got a pair of shoes for you, but keep your rags anyway. It's, yeah, it's yeah. They're... All right, which way are we going? Back uh, up? The, the, Is up. it raining outside? Uh, for me, it's not. Well, I'm trying to figure I'll out why it's dark. Outside. No, it stopped raining. See, it's it's near sunset for us. The sun is still up, Ken, uh, Reaper. Yeah, it's near, but I'm, where I was at, it was dark. Like, behind trees, behind houses. <laughs> it's not raining now. Hey, Karen. All right. Oh, I like your hat. <clears throat> oh, sorry, I was. My wife was wearing a tiara. The kids were dressing her up or something. <laughs> Apparently. Like, but it's not like a normal tiara. It's like a tiara from one of their dolls. Oh. Where are you? At? Let's go this way. Have you seen the hatch? No. Hey, were you gonna do what you said you were gonna do? Uh, well, I didn't turn. No, I, I'm just. Were you gonna hide something? Something about hiding something. Okay. I did already. You... Okay. <clears throat> now they're watching the Olympics and apparently doing my wife's makeup and dressing her up. I don't, actually, I don't think we can go this way. Oh. Sorry. Oh, found a machete. Damaged oh. though, but... That will fit on your sling if you get an, uh, a sling. Well, you, you, you need a scabbard. If you find a scabbard, keep it. Well, what's the one that you got on yours? That green handle that, one. Well, I'll show you. If you take it off, if I take this off, it's also got this other part to it called the scabbard. Right, right. So there's three parts. There's the sling, the scabbard, and then that goes in that slot. I got a sharpening stone, too. I'm going to use it on the machete. Oh, that's sharpening stone. You can make them on here, but they take forever to make. And if you have one that's got a couple of uses on it, it's just like liquid gold. My machete was damaged, so I repaired it. I have a lot After of uses. I've played on here for a while. You go on other servers, and it's like... The survival of the game is just the aspect is just non issue. For sure. the food on us and water we could make it very quickly up to Cernaya. Um I have a some water but I'm hesitant to drink out of it until I boil it oh. because last time I drank out of it I was sick oh. and I got sick because of the rain I'm not wet yet so yeah no um, I, well we're also in the trees so if it is still raining well, you get and we're bugged the trees uh, you're, you're protected a little bit. They act like little umbrellas. It's like today. I went on a bike ride IRL, and it was raining pretty heavy pace. And But I was in the woods um, in a greenway that we have. And uh, I barely got wet. Yeah. You didn't get sick. That's for damn sure. What was that? I couldn't hear you. You didn't get sick. That's for damn sure. No. Hell no. 
Yeah, influenza here on here apparently what comes from. What volume have you got Reaper on uh, Discord at? I might be Reaper's thing. Let me check. Got to jump into the channel. I have him at 100%. I have him at that or more, and I can hardly hold on, hold on. hear him talk when he's talking to you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It might it might have just been further it away. It could from his be mic. the mic isn't close enough. Uh... That's one of the nice things about Discord is you can bump people up behind 100. percent So yeah, yeah. Yeah, just turn them up until you can hear them good. Yeah, yeah. I have a you know the boom mic that hangs off my headset. I mean, I could stick my tongue out and touch it if yeah. I wanted to. Oh okay. no. Yeah, let's go this but way. I, I may have my stuff turned. Anybody Boy, watching is going to be really confused where we are. Very soon. Because it's always so fucking loud here. <laughs> I'll turn up my headset a bit for you, and that also helps. I, I, um, I think it's improved now. I just got one of these um, cardioid mics, and i got to be right next to it. Otherwise, it doesn't pick up. Is that the Sure mic that you got? Yeah, yeah. I saw a YouTube about that uh, that versus USB. Well, this one is the USB version. This is the Shure MV7 yeah. 1.0. There's a 2.0 now. That's a nice one. And so it's a complete USB. It has XLR, but it also has USB. Yeah, yeah. And so the USB makes it very versatile because it has its own built-in um, amplifiers. Yeah. I want to try to make it a bit further before we... Before it gets dark. Too dark, that is. Yeah. And yeah, we don't have night vision. Shit. Wow. I don't. And it hadn't been as dark on the server, but the last couple of times I've been on, it's been dark. Now, granted, it was also cloudy. So, if we get a cloudless night, we might be okay. We'll see. I'm getting those sticky keys every time I press. You can disable those in Windows. You just... Well, he, he go. did his computer, so... Oh, yeah, that's right. I keep forgetting that. Because I, I know we went through this before. Yeah, I have to, I yeah that was the old computer. Search. I know where we are now. Oh, a good old hydro line. How about that? Let's go this way. Oh, yeah. Ever have the EVR storm? No. Okay. Every okay. once in a while, I feel That'd like that'd be a fan off. If they have that, I think they should have that in here. That'd be awesome. I think uh, the Molskus Fallen did, but yeah. they closed that server, didn't they? Mm-hmm. I got the walking slow bug again. Oh, it's like control it's twice, I think. Uh, what is it? Sh control twice? Yeah, left control. Yeah. And then hold shift. Not giving me the go. No, just double control. It's just like the double alt, where alt freezes your, your view. Yeah, I'm still too slow. Oh, you can cut up zombies in this. That's awesome. Of playing stalker, you know, you're always cutting out units to sell it. their parts. Can't run. Well, hit shift. shift, hit shift, and try to run. No, weird. Press control twice, like, don't hold it or anything. Well, he can also escape out of okay, life. I got it now. Run. I got it now. Okay, okay, but it's it's not, it's a little faster than the jog. 
So you can also get out of the, the, the double control by just starting to try to run. At least I've got it set up that way. I don't know if that's something you have to do. I didn't set any key bindings to it, but it's getting Well, control dark. is set up by... What, what Strike is trying to say is control is by default. So yeah, if, you, if you press control twice, it defaults you to just keep walking. So what, talking. what were you doing with the rags and the rope and trying to make a sling? So if you have six rags... You keep yeah. your distance because um, you're um, losing you. Oh, it's starting to rain. Yeah. And I don't see you very well. You're right here, yeah. Uh, let's find stay, somewhere. Stay on the hydro line. Yeah. What yeah. we'll do is we'll... I'll try, once to we get, I'll try to skyline you, but... Yeah, we'll just stay on the hydro line and try to keep, keep me in view. We're going to get soaked again. We're going to probably want to go to that one house. I think the rain's going to slow us down this time. So I take the rags and... So two stacks of six rags together can make a rope. Okay, so if I have a rope... Two ropes make I a slide. I do not see you at oh. all. There you are. I got the orange bag. You should be able to see me. Nope. Dark and rainy. Now I don't see you. Alright. Hold on, Red. Let's go. Let's see here. I'm in the in the I'm in the power lines. Oh, fuck. Okay, I got you. Oh, you do. Hungry. Oh, there I see you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so just keep the power lines above your head. Yeah, yeah, but it's keeping you in proximity. The worst that can happen right now is that we run into a dog. We won't see shit. Yeah. We better grab a stick or two before we get down to the house, or? Well, my problem right now is I'm, I'm holding something. Oh. So, what should be right in front of us when I can barely make out some of the houses is Electro. Um, so what we want to do right now is I gotta carefully. Let me. Okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna hit options. Audio. I'm gonna turn effects volumes to max. So turn your effects volume to max. Okay, that way you can hear my footsteps as best you can. Options. Audio. And what is it? Effects to max? Yeah. Yeah. That'll allow us to hear each other a little bit better. Because what we don't want to do is follow those power lines all the way down because we'll get attacked, ravaged by Zeds. Yeah. Well, there's what two or three now houses is, on the left side, right? Yeah. You're going right? I, can, I can't no, no, see. I'm, I can't I'm, see. I'm, I'm, I'm still. I haven't moved. Why don't we make oh. a stick and put... I got some rags. We'll make a flare. Well, the problem is we won't be able to light it. It's going to be wet. Oh, shit. So what we need to do now is look 90 degrees. Look, look straight up. Yeah. So, that you, so that the power lines are above your head. Yeah. Get yourself 90 degrees to the power lines. Yeah. Look down. Yeah. Okay, you're right in front of me. Yeah. We're going to go in this direction. So you walk so I can see you walk by. Just walk by really slowly. Okay, there you are. So we just want to stay near each other and go in this rough direction. All right. And hope that we don't run into any Zeds. And what you want right, to do I is look... I lost you already. I can't see you. Okay, don't worry about me so much. Keep those mountains. See how there's like a mountain on the left and a mountain on the right? Yeah. And in the middle, there seems to be like a little... Like a V. Two little... Two little yeah. Head towards that. Okay, just keep going and I'll hear you when you walk by and I'll start to move. Okay, I see it right here. Okay. Oh, this is nuts. Have well, you this is the way it used to... This have is you the got way a flashlight? Because I, I got a battery. I don't have a flashlight, no. Wait, right, hold, up, hold up wherever you are. Okay, let's do this. What we can do is... Do you know how to auto-walk on here? No, I don't want to auto-walk. Well, if you auto-walk, we'll be going the same speed. Oh, my God. Where are you now? My screen is black. My <laughs> friends cannot see a thing. <laughs> 
Are you ahead or behind me? I can't tell. Try moving oh. back and forth. Move around like... I'm going in circles here. But I'm keeping the V straight in front of me. I can't see shit now. Oh. Keep moving in circles. I'm going to try to get... I can't even see the V anymore. I can see one hill and the other hill, but I don't know where the V is. Maybe we should have stayed at the, the cave. <laughs> uh, let's see. If I got a... Oh. Wait a minute. I got a glow stick. <laughs> Hold on. Pop that sucker. Can I put it so I don't lose it? I'll put it on the ground. Well, you can put it. You can put it. Um, okay, I got it. Oh, you put it on your bag. Yeah. Or if you have a rope belt. All right. See the red. See Hold the on. Red, red glow stick. Where are you? I don't. Oh, I see it now. Hold on. Stay still. Stay still. Now, you say that'll go on the bag? That will, but it's probably best you hold it. Okay. Because put it on your back. Try putting it on your bag real quick. We'll see what right, difference I'll it be makes. you carry this, and I'll carry what you got, and I'll follow you. Okay, hold on a second. Because we completely lost our bearings now. Because I don't know which... Well, if you look up that way, over there, see where I'm pointing? There's one big hill there, and there's another hill over there. The valley's straight in front of us, like that. See that? Right now, my night vision is sort of kind of swapped because of uh, that thing. Let me do something real quick. I'm going to pull my compass out. God, I hope I have a compass. I don't know. What I think I do. This I'm is this is one a compass. Oh, man. I thought I had one. Oh, man. We're going to get Hold sucked on. to the ass here. Yeah, there's nothing we can do about that. Okay. No compass there. Shit, I passed up a compass. I thought, I already got one. And I did, but I left it up in the barrel. Damn it. Okay. Uh, Hold we got, on. Can we find... Let me bring up a map. Hold on. Well, no, no, I, I know where we idea. are. I have an we idea. have to point in the right direction. Because you might think that's the hill, but if that's not the hill, we could be in the swarm of zombies and dead. I don't think we went that far south. We no, I know, where, I know exactly where we are. The road's just down here to the right. I know, we don't want to go on the road. No, that's what I'm trying the to say. road is just down there. Electro's right no. back that way. See, I can't there. see shit right now. There's I don't road. see. I don't see electro. Can't you see the sky? Look up in the sky. Okay, hold on. Put 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 the put the, put the glow plug uh, away. Okay, hold on. Let me find somewhere to put it. I oh my god! He, they, they put that mod back on here. You dropped, You left your bolt on the ground? No, I did not. How the hell did we just happen to stop where somebody had a damaged bolt on the ground? There's a bolt on the ground. It's not mine. Okay, that's what I'm I, put the, I put the thing in my bag, but that's probably not a good idea. It's two damaged bolts. Okay, wait. Nope. I can stack them because I got two. I got a slot here already with two. Okay. Oh, it doesn't fit. I got. I got them. I got the. Okay, I got okay. the bolts. I'll use them. All right. So I have the the bag. Oh my, my good God! Is there a honey here. stand up here somewhere? Here, um. Yeah, that might be why we found the bolts. Somebody might be loot cycling, which is not good. Um, here, um, take the take the thing off. I want to. I want. I don't want my my. Let me let me take the. There you go. There you go. Okay, watch. I'm going to put the fishing pole down. Yeah. I'm gonna drop that. Okay, I'm just oh. gonna spin around until. Where did the bag go? Don't worry, it's here. Uh -huh. I I don't this see anything but the rain. Crazy. 
This is absolutely nuts. Now I'm getting cold. Okay, okay now, okay, I was looking at the ground. Hold on. I'm going to pull this out again. Make sure I'm... Okay, there we go. That was... It's like, I can't see shit, Red. That's because my character was looking down at the ground. Okay, I'm spinning around here. You hear a chicken? Jesus. Oh, no. <laughs> oh this is All fun. Right. All right, let's... Okay, I, I see hills. The problem is, which one is... I know, I know, here, look, the way I'm looking right here, oh, look okay. at me. I'm looking at a tree. Look at me. Hold on, Red. What's uphill? This is still the direction we're going that you told me to go. Over this way. Okay. Here, let's do this. Okay, I'm going to take this. I'm going to give you that. What do you want me to give me? Sweater? No, I, I moved. Uh, I moved the the bolts, the two damaged bolts. Actually, you can't do that because you got your. You want fishing me to carry line. your fishing rod? No, that's that's. Just break the fishing rod down and carry only the rope. That way, it's smaller. That's my fishing rod, isn't it? It is. Yeah, but. Oh, carry, I got a knife. Or what do I use? You, I got a knife. Hold on. Put it down on the ground real quick. All right, it's on the ground. Okay. Okay, so there's everything. I'm gonna. All right, you want me I'm to carry the bag? You take the light. No, you carry the bag. Yeah. Leave the light on the ground for a second. I'm right. I'm gonna judge where uphill is, and we're gonna go uphill again, at an angle towards where I think the thing is. Okay, so what, what, what oh, thing oh, you want to go to? You want? Oh, where'd the light go? Right there. Okay, rotate 180 degrees. I'm, I'm right behind you. I'm right behind you. Okay. Hold on. Here we go. Go straight up. All right. You just don't go too fast. I'll follow you. Just gonna take these little baby steps. Yeah, yeah. We're trying to. Okay. Here's. Here, we're in the. This is the forest. Yeah. Okay. We we'll get under the tree. We'll get. And if, if knowing so knowing the contours is gonna help us. We're going to try to go along the outskirts of the too forest. Don't go fast. I'm losing your light. Okay. I got to put the bag. On. Let me put the bag on my back. Hold on. Why am I carrying it? What the hell am I doing? What am I thinking here? <laughs> yeah. Okay. yeah, have your crossbow out because God knows what might happen in there. All right. I okay, so we just passed the power lines, and we're we're following the contour of the hill. The, the hill right. has sort of kind of a shape How to it. How far over to the... I can almost see the hydro line from here. When you look to the How left. Many gamma settings do you have? Because I can't see shit. Let me look at your stream really quick, because... On, on my stream, screen, you won't be able I just, to see anything, because it is shit. Hold on a second. Because, see, on my screen, all I see is a, is a wall of black. Um, but the other day I was playing with one of you guys and you said it was, you could make stuff out. So if we go back, you see where I'm standing in front of you right here. If we go back this way and follow it to the, con to the hydro line, that's where it is. I, I can, hold on a second. Hold on, Red. You've got that on your back. You're carrying it in your, oh, you got it in your back. Yeah, because you got to carry something. Why don't you? Um, if I hold on, the hydro line is going to be in this direction. Yeah. What we'll do is we'll just walk up till we see it. There it is. I see it now. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Now let me get in. Let me get on my map and see where in the hell we are. I know where we are. Yeah, but I want to find the, the building. The building we want to go to is that um, we don't want to go to any. I'll if you go to hospital. any other buildings. No, no, no. We go, we go into town. We're dead. Yeah, we are dead. They're, they'll destroy us right. down in there. We can't right. see them. Yeah, though. we got to find a shed to get out of the rain. Well, and make well I know, fire. I know where we need to go. We need to go towards the dam. Yeah, I know. Um, okay, so what I'm gonna do is but you're going the wrong way now. No, no, yeah, no. This is the dam. I'm going in the direction of the dam now. I'm facing the dam. You are. Yes. Oh, turn around this way. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So what we're gonna okay. do is. 
Um, we're going to go straight parallel to these two... Um, Wait, don't, two... don't move oh, yet. I'm looking something up. No, no, up. hold on. Uh, I'm not going anywhere. Don't worry. I'm just moving back and forth. There we go. Okay, so I want to move parallel to these posts that should be relatively due north. Or not north, but close enough. It's probably a, northeast. There is another so hydro go, line. If we go down no, the hill yeah, yeah. from here, this is we're on the major power line going uh, yeah. into into electro. No electro. Yeah, yeah. All right. If we go down the hill to the a little bit to the left over here, just go straight down. We will hit a hydro line, and then if we f and go, we'll follow the hydro line to the left towards the dam. Yes. Yeah. Well, that's the, that's where I'm trying to take us. I'm trying to take right. us. So let's go down that go other hydro oh, line oh, down oh, the hill. I don't want to go to the dam. We go to the dam. The zombies there are going to kill us. Exactly. What we want to do is we want to go to that little house that's all by itself that's just before the second dam. If you look at that, you know. Right. Okay. So right now we should be lined up well, to be going some... straight for the dam. Okay. So when I'm looking at my game, I'm – just stay there. I'm basically going up and down – straight across i'm perfectly perpendicular to these two posts which should set me off on a northeast trajectory i don't want to go northeast i want to go more north so that i can get to that house so what i'm going to do is i'm going to set a i'm going to set a direction and i'm not going to deviate from it i'm going to double alt so that i can't change my direction just go slow so I'm turning a little bit here. Okay. Hopefully that's roughly north. Okay, you ready? Yeah. I'm going to double alt so that I can't... Yeah, okay, I'm double alted. And I'm just committed to this direction. Right. Okay. <laughs> Even if we don't make it to the house... I mean, if we go anywhere else, Red, we're in trouble. Because there's zombies and other things that will get us um so we can't you know the other thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna wa i'm gonna look at the ground as we're walking on it yeah that's gonna give me an idea of roughly where we are once we enter the forest i'm gonna stop moving so we're in the forest now okay yeah, right I wanna, you. yeah yeah so if we start to to the right a little bit. Hold on. Because the bush... We're going to pass underneath... Oh, this is the question. Are we... Okay, let's keep going and see if you look, see another hydro line above our heads. Oh, that'll be good. And well, that'll be... Once we exit the bush here, just a second. Okay, we... Okay, oh, hold on. This is just spotty trees here. Hopefully we'll run straight into a power line. This is the smaller power line. So we're still in the for forest. We gotta go more to the... Oh, we're in an opening now. Yeah, this is what we want. I think I see a power okay. line above us. You do? Oh, hold on. I'm going to look around. Yeah, if you use your scroll mouse, scroll straight ahead. Don't you see wires up there at all? Oh, yeah. Okay, good, good. This is where we want to be. Jesus, this is hilarious. Is Strucky and, and Gin there? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I'm in Trinaya having a fire. Okay. Rain got me soaked. <laughs> so we're here now. So we want to keep, we're still going due north, roughly. Watch the floor, the ground. As we start to go uphill, let me know, okay? Yeah. So we want I to watch. I think we're on the side of the hill still. It's kind oh, no, of we are. a bit blue to the left, eh? Look up to the left up there. The clouds are breaking up. Maybe. 
So just keep going in this direction. We're going uphill. We're on the side of the hill, but we're also going to be going uphill. If you bring up the contour map, if of the if you bring up Daisy Day, just so that you're comfortable and know where we are, we just passed underneath that second. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So that's line, the right? big black one, and down to the right is a little pond down but down yeah. near the road. We definitely don't want to go down there. If we go down right. there, we're going to get the zombies that spawn all along that road. All right, but so we're, we're in the middle of the field, so we've got a that yeah. other power line. It's just down the hill here a little bit. Well, if we go down there, we're going to get too close to Cometa, and the zombies that are down there are going to see us. There's a hunting what stand I up the hill right here somewhere. Is there? I know there's one nearby, but I'm, at the moment, we're so... Uh, yeah, we could run into it. Let's see. Let's just... we we'll just commit to this. We don't want to keep make, changing direction. Make note of the elevations to the right oh, of oh, us. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. I can make out the tree line now. Yeah. Oh, and that's what I'm... That's so what. I, stop real quick. If you look at the contour lines of the mountain... On the right we're side. We're going... We're going up yeah, the, the valley. On the right side. Because yeah, that, well, that, that's... See hold, my hold arms? On, right. Straight and, there. And that's, I don't, that's where the road goes. Right through what, what I'm saying yeah. is right now, I believe that I'm on a north... Relatively northern trajectory through this... And I believe we began our journey at the double power hydro line. Yeah, that's where um, we were. That was a major power no, line. No, 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 hold on, hold on. What I'm trying to say is I have a pretty good idea of where we were on that power line based on the fact that we were in a clearing. And so, and now the fact that we went through two sets of woods and that we're at another power line, yeah. I believe we should be very close to, uh, if not right, it should, might be right in front of us, the other deer stand. If that's the case then we are on a perfect northerly trajectory, maybe just a little bit too much to the west, which should take us straight to the house, okay? So let's just see if we met, run into this into this uh, deer stand here. Just yeah, keep looking it'll, to your it'll left. It'll be up on the edge of the bush, though. Right? I know. Once we hit the bush, we'll, we'll know to look around. Right now, we haven't hit the woods yet, the bush yet, so... This is suicide. No, it's not, Red. I used to do this all the time on official... Travel at night, look at just the shadows of stuff. Okay, here we go. Oh. Okay, hold on. We're almost there. Here's the bush. Look to your left. Can't see anything but green. Yeah. The problem is to the right, everything is just really dark. We don't have the sky, the outline. Okay, watch. I'm gonna I'm gonna take this. Yeah, let me let me make a, a guess here. We started here. There, that's Electro, the valley. See the valley behind us? That yeah. hill on the you're, left? Okay, here's what you're going to do. You're going to sit still. Okay, you move up to where I am right now. Yeah. Hold on, wait till I'm I hit some trees more. Okay, right here. I will find you. Uh because where are you, Red? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you're going to find me. Good luck. Well, are, you, are you behind I'm, me is what I'm, I'm trying right to say. Here, yeah. you okay, okay, okay. I'm following you or so, you want me to stand I'm here dropping, in the dark? Yeah, I want you to stand here in the dark. No okay. fucking way. I don't have a gun. Hold on, Red. Hold on. Hold on, Red. You dropped the... Don't move. I know, I know. I know what I did. I know what I did. Okay, I just created... Um, don't pick up the light. Just leave it there. I have a, a line. You see this line between here and my... Yeah. And my... Uh, and that, that thing... Okay, I'm going to leave you here. You stay there. I'm going to look and see if I can find this thing here. If you if you want me to pick up the light, I will so you be able to no, see don't, it. Don't 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 worry about it right now. Oh. Yeah, because that st that heat that hunting stand should be right behind you. Like right up to the left from here where I'm standing. See, I, I just went up to the left. And I don't see it. I'm about to pass you. I'm walking backwards. I hear a bear. Oh, for fuck's sake. Red, don't move. Shit. 
I'm done. Red, don't talk that way. That, that that came from the bush up where you went. I don't even know where you are anymore. You want me this, to pick this this server? No, don't pick it up. Don't pick it up. Don't stand on top of it though. Take a couple steps back. Because if you're yeah. standing on top of it, you're gonna make it so I can't see it. Right. So the the problem is some of the mods on this server. Oh, I see it. I see it. Don't move. The mods on this server, the lighting mods, make lights disappear after a certain distance. And it's really stupid. I don't understand it. All right. You want um, to pick up your stuff there? Because this is a survival server. You shouldn't be penalized. Yeah. Where's the other stuff? You got it. You got the mark. No, where's the, where's the green bag? The green thing. Oh. It was straight ahead of you. No, no, no. Not that. Okay, you stay there. Don't move. Don't move, Red. Jesus. I found it. I found it. I found it. Don't move. Don't move. Oh, look. Okay, hold on. Yeah, okay, yeah. cool. I got, I got, I got, I can, now that the rain is slowing down, yeah, I can it's see. It's getting a bit lighter out where I am. It's getting lighter here, but I want to get away from the bear. We're going straight towards the bear. Well, I don't know why he'd be down here. Hey, just, just come with me. Did he sound like he was in your right ear, your oh, left, left ear? Left ear, left ear. Okay, well, we're not going that way. That's more towards Pusta. Okay, we're going to start going down towards the... Oh, here's the power line, Red. Are we on the power line? Yeah, we're on the other power line. Okay, and I can see the road now, too, to the right. Did I hear a growl? Now, the, now we can actually see the mountains and shit. The rain slowed oh down a tiny God. bit. This is tense. Yeah. I don't know what's worse, Namalsk or this. I should have stayed in Namalsk. At least I had a gun and bullets. Oh, you got 4,000 in chat right now, right? They're all <laughs> ripped away looking. Oh, there's Going a hay bale. There must be a farm here. Look. Yeah, be careful. This is, there's a zombie that hangs around here near the road. Don't get too far ahead. Oh, we're on the road now. Where are you? I'm right here. I got you. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is, yeah. It's like uh, out of a, like some kind of comedy, you know. It's At like night, it's like comedy of errors. Something like, else, and then during the day, you're still hiding from the zombies and the wolves and the bears and the. Well, in complete darkness, which I, I like what that brings to the game. But crap, the fact that we didn't have a light until you found this on your in your bag. I can't walk fast. I, I got a cramp. See, I've not been collecting lights on here because for the last three or four months, the dark the night has not been dark. I'm crouch walking. Like, only when it rained was it dark. Maybe maybe it'll be the same once it, once this clears up. Okay, I'm gonna stay right here, wait for you. I'm right here. That must be the hospital down there. Yeah, yeah, let's be careful. We don't wanna aggro any of them. Okay, just follow the road for now. Don't follow the hydro line at this point. Ugh, that was that, that, not being able to see when I went up that hill for a bit. I couldn't make my way back down because of that. The um, is that the first that, is that the first pond that we see? Well, there's there's the the um, the dam. The dam, yeah. That's the first dam, right? Correct. Yeah. So are we past we're, the hospital? No, we're we're yeah we're past the hospital. No, we're not. The first pond is before the hospital. The second no, this pond is, and the dam is where the hospital is. We, the dam is, 
if you if the dam is more north than the hospital. Yeah, it is. Because it's it's what keeps the water from. All right, are we getting in that house, or are we gonna be? Almost, 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 almost. We've got a little bit to go. I see. And, uh, I see the house. We'll... No, no, not that house. Well, why no, we're not? Go... Any house will do. That one's out in the middle of nowhere. Somebody will see us. I'll start a fire that come kill us. There's okay. the road. Let's take. I got a car. Don't forget. I, also... have a, I have a crossbow. Don't forget that. Well, I got one too. But here, take this power line here. See it? Silas, so, you know if the green military towers have loot or no? I mean, they took those out of Daisy proper mm. a couple years ago. I don't know if he's put loot on here specifically. Because they can create their own right? custom. But I've never really found loot in them. Hold on a second. I Let's... think it's just vanilla. Uh, we're going to be running into... Uh, yeah, we, we want to run into the creek because we want to get to the dam and then the dam is our next waypoint to the house. Yeah, but we got to get behind... Hey, we're, we're at the dam. We're at the creek, okay? So we want to go along the creek bed. Are you behind me? I'm right behind you, but the creek bed goes under the bridge where the bar is and there's a goddamn hospital with all the zombies in it. No, that's that's the uh, that's the military tents. Oh fuck, that's even worse. Yeah, yeah. Let's just try to stay to the left here until we get to the second dam. I'm crouch walking all the way, and now I need a bath. Holy shit! Okay. So what we'll do is, once we get to the dam, we I'm can here. line ourselves up with a dam and walk straight up from the dam to the house, because that's but how I, I get. But there. I'm yellow hygiene. That's okay. You got time. Three arrows down. You got time. You got time. Go ahead and stop crouch watching because there's the house. I see it. I think I see it. Yeah, that's part of the roof line. I see it. We got here just in time for the rain to stop. Yeah. Start another fire so that we can dry off. Is there water nearby? Yeah, yeah. But we'll have to boil it. I already have some water, but we have to boil it still because... I was sick last time I drank from it. Okay, oh, up in here. You got a you got a lock pick or something? What? No, no, no. We're good. We're good. You can use a rag if you really feel bad about it, but I wouldn't do it because then we have to bust out of here. It's not not worth it. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna. Oh, all right. Uh, hold on. One, two. Okay, where's my axe? Why is my hatchet? I got an axe. You want a hatchet? I got it. Never mind. I found it. I found it. I have a hatchet slot on my backpack, but I forgot that I found a a hatchet case for my 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 belt. Okay. You just gonna get a couple of trees? Yeah, I'm gonna get some logs, and we'll need bark. I got two bark. I'm gonna get a little bit more firewood here. I'll close the second door. Yeah, we're we're relatively safe up here. There are no zombies that come up this far. Yeah, but they they're gonna smell me. Yeah, we'll get you washed up, don't worry. Yeah, I got two matches left. Yeah, go ahead and use your matches then. That way, you, since you've only got two left, you'll end up freeing up one slot. So, I don't even see the house on the map here. Yeah, it's right here. I mean, I, I just know it. I know it's here, so I know what to look for on the map. But it's right above the second dam. Oh, okay. Just to the south, uh, west of the dam. I'm gonna go just so we. Oh crap! Did you close both doors? Close one. Hold on. Let me. 
I'm gonna drink all of this, and then I'm gonna get you some fresh water. I figure if I get sick from my own food, my now my my food is pretty high, so hopefully my, my immunity. Well, worst case, around the fire, we, it's still early. We can try to sleep. And um, oh, we should try and sleep now because the sun's coming up. Yeah, might want to might want to go ahead and do that just to boost our immunity. Yeah, but I've wet when you clothes. sleep. I'll put the clothes put, on. Yeah, ground, just I guess. Yeah, put all the clothes on. Go go into a corner so we don't confuse our stuff. Like go over here. Okay, I'll put them over Probably. here. Okay. Yeah, but they got to dry by the fireplace. Right. Yeah, we'll be here long enough for them to dry. Don't worry, I'm gonna. Bring everything out first, right? Because it then will dry. Faster. It'll dry out faster, yeah. Yep. Oh man, listen to all the water coming out of those pants. I'm gonna go ahead and actually sleep. Oh, it was a about long storm. Oh, it was yeah. a long night. Tell me, we were in the field, mm. couldn't see the hand in front of our face, and we did have. I just heard a shot down at Novo somewhere. Did you pick up one of the carbines uh, on the way out? No, no. Alright, I'm getting off. Yeah, yeah. Where are you yeah, at, work, uh, work, Reaper? Work tomorrow. Where'd you I'm make it to, at, uh, Reaper? I'm at that Carmen, whatever. Carmenovka, whatever. Oh, Carmenovka, okay. yeah. yeah Careful, uh, Carmenovka is known for snakes, so. Well, I, just, I ended up just north of the town. Oh. Okay, okay. There's just, there's a place that has a lot of snakes. In Karmanovka, every time I've been, which is, uh, there's like a, there's a, I think it's an erect Ada that's parked out front. It's one of the, I think it's the piano house. Oh, the Karmanovka. piano house, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's some snakes out in the yard. Pretty much always there every time I've been, so. Can you outrun them? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Oh. And you, you can kill them with your bare hands, but I don't recommend it just in case you do get bit. Okay, oh, I slept and I got I got a so. <laughs> immunity buff red, yeah. so I, I definitely recommend you sleep before the. Yeah, I'm going down right now after this last. Before it's too late. All right, I'll talk to y'all. No, later, man. All right, take easy. Yeah. No third person on here, eh? No. Oh no, no. Hardcore, man. Hardcore shit. Uh, my rest level is 61. I don't, I don't even go into third person on third person servers. Yeah, it's Only so rarely yeah. I have to. Maybe if you're driving, if you yeah. really feel like it, but that's about it for me. Yeah, I don't even do it driving. I drive in first person. Yeah. Once in a blue moon, I might go into third person if I'm driving. If I have to, like, back up or something. It depends on the car I'm in. But... So you said we passed, so we passed the military already? Military is just, it's nearby. We're very close to the military. Okay, I see we, the we have, we have We have passed it though, yeah. But I mean, we're very close to it. Yeah. Couldn't tell you that we're far away from it for sure. But I think I see the house, the dam is right down almost in front of us. Right? Yeah, correct. That's why yeah, I, see I, I saw the house, so we didn't have to go to the dam. But normally, if I don't know where the hell I am because it's dark, you know, yeah. I try to find the dam because it sticks out. It's very white. Yeah. Um, and then I line myself up with the wall of the dam 
and I go in a straight line, and that will pretty much get you in the backyard of this house. Yeah. You know? So we can go down and wash in that big water then. Yeah. Exactly. I'm up at 83 already. Yeah, I'm still... How much food do you got on you? I got no food on me left. All right, left so I'm going to have to fish. Yeah, we, we do, yeah. That's why I said we'll probably be here for a while. The rain in the night definitely slowed us down. If it hadn't been for that, we would probably already be in three rivers or three gorges by now. Where are we going to Bush's place? That's the that's the that's the first spot, yeah. Okay, I got back to ninety seven. your wristwatch here yeah I, I tried to pick it up just now and i accidentally put something else on one of the daisy used to be pretty stable like stuff on the ground like would not change the order like if your hat was the first thing it would always be the first thing but about two or three years ago they did something and now when there's a lot especially when there's a lot of stuff on the ground it just starts randomly changing order like the hat will become the last thing and then the first thing the last thing and i'm like what the hell are these guys doing I had something on like, slot two and three. I don't see it anymore. Well, you got to put all your clothing on. I have it all. You have all your... You do? Oh, okay. Weird. What did you have? I don't remember. I had my... I had my crossbow. Um... Well, let's see. My rope belt's still here. You got the chem light. Yep. You put your bag on a... I think I heard no. a chicken. <clears throat> there might be a chicken out there, but it would be new. How many bones to make a knife? Just one. <clears throat> but if I use six, only... I lose them all, don't I? Well, no, 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 no. Okay, so here's the deal. If you have a stack of bones uh -huh. in your hand, you can create a bone knife without a stone, but it'll use two bones rather than one. Okay. If you have, <clears throat> if you have a small stone in your hand, and you take or a boulder on the ground. Yeah. And you look at those with bones, it'll only use one. So it's a better idea to to not use two bones. So if you have yeah. a small stone I go outside and make it. Yeah. Go out and find a rock is your best bet. But the best thing to do is always have a small stone on you so that you can make a knife. Easily. I have a Winchester that's kind of in bad shape. And I have a rope. And I have one hook already. Dang, we've gone down from four logs to two. I'm going to go get you some water so we can boil it.
Oh, did you take the bark off the ground to put on the fire, or it's okay? Yeah, it, it'll extend the fire a little bit. There's right. no reason to carry it around because we don't have a lot of storage. Right. So we only have two left on here. So you want me to get some more sticks? Yeah, yeah. We need to find some rocks so we can make more stones, more sharpening stones. How are your shoes <clears throat> still badly damaged? Yeah, that'll be good. We can go fishing now. Cook the fish. I'm good on food. Um, just because I had to gorge myself to get rid of my sickness earlier. But we may want to stack up on a lot of it. That way, if we do get sick again, that's we can heal it ourselves that way. Do you want to go ahead and start fishing, or...? Red, do you want to go fishing? I don't know if you're talking, but I can't hear you. Sorry. My wife okay. passed by and I... All good. Do I need worms to fish? I think it's better to get worms, or... It's better. It increases yeah, your chances. Yeah, it's better. <clears throat> fishing rod. Uh, I should have a hook here. Oh wait, I'll go put the rod down. I have bait. Damn it. My chlorine tabs are ruined. I didn't ha I just realized I had some on me here in the bag. Do you have another rope or no? I have one rope, yeah. You gonna make a fishing rod? No, I don't need one. I have an actual fishing rod. Alright. So I have the, the baited hook. Oh, put the bag on. Once that water cools down, right now it's still really hot. I mean, let me move over here. Sometimes I find things near the fire don't cool down as fast. Is it a stream or is it? Yeah, there's a stream and there's also a big lake. Where yeah, the yeah. dam is behind the lake, or yeah. the lake is behind the dam, I should say.
This is the time of day to fish, though, because it's morning. Yeah. Morning and evening. Any other time of day, you could be out here for hours. I'm not kidding. Yeah. And often I catch more shoes than I in pots than I do anything else. Mm. But shoes aren't a bad thing to have. So. I got the buff, so I have to bath as well. Yeah, I would do that. Well, I'm still. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna do that after I get this. Oh, you got something. Yeah, I got this. Uh, oh, a pair, a pair of, of boots. Badly damaged, so I can take those. Oh fuck, they're huge. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to I'm going to bath right now. I think you said you have wellies on right now that are badly damaged. Yeah, they seem you to could... be wearing wear very well. Yeah, the, the, well, the, the if if in speaking in terms of distance, the distance from um worn to damaged is small compared to badly damaged to ruined because badly damaged is the the last the last of it you know after that it's ruined and so it's like i think like pristine to worn is like 20 percent, so 100 to 80 80 to 70 i think is damaged maybe 60 um, then badly damaged is like 50 to zero. So it's like, or maybe 40 to zero. So like, it's just a much bigger chunk of the, of the life is that last chunk. I wish there was like another one called about to fall off. That way you're like, okay, I'm going to get rid of these things. Yeah. Yeah. But then that doesn't become realistic. Yeah. Well, you know, at the same time, you think you'd be able to look at it. It's like about a year or two ago when they first added clothes falling off when they're ruined. I told John, you guys need to do something about this because I like it. At the same time, though, if clothing fell off my body, I'd know it. Yeah. You know, if I were walking around the street and all of a sudden my shoes fell off, I would immediately feel the difference. And I said, you got to have some kind of indicator, right? Just something that so that people know, because otherwise it just it breaks the immersion. You know, my clothing just fell off and I didn't know, and that's why they added the ripping sound. The ripping sound was added so that we have some kind of indication that you know something bad just happened. And now it's one of those things where I wish the ripping sound happened on vanilla or some kind of effect, Vino. because so yeah. many times you know I'm like, you know using a pair of bad gloves and I end up cutting my hand because the gloves are no longer working or my shoes become ruined and I have no idea, you know? So there's there's actually a bit of an advantage uh, to both, you know? You, granted, on vanilla, you know, a ruined bag doesn't fall off and so you can keep using it, so... So in my opinion, the CHF way is, is definitely harder. Okay, I need another... Ooh. Is Minnow in your chat or something? Oh, my hook is ruined. Shit. There's a rock here. I can take a bone. One bone at a time, right? Yeah. Is is Minnow in your chat? Yeah, he just came in to say hello. Well, he, maybe he's been there a bit. But Thank no, God, I don't shit. want to make a bone knife. I want to, I want bones to make hooks. Well, or not bone? Uh, yeah, I want to make I want to make hooks. So is so it two for a hook or one for a hook? No, no, no. Okay, a hook is a, any knife combined with bones. Okay, so I need to make a knife first. Okay. Yeah. I bet that's what you're getting at. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so now okay, I got the knife. So I split the bones. Take one here. Where in the hell did I Jesus. go? This, this is the prime time for catching fish, and I've got a damn thing. Oh, I made a knife, but... Oh, there it is. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and, and use a... a I shit. only can make one hook with one knife. Okay, so a, a, a knife plus a bone creates one bone hook. 
Okay. If you have a stack of bones, it'll just create one bone hook from that. So. No, I'm doing it individually. Yeah. I well, just create one for now because you don't want to go through all your bones. Yeah, you're, you're, as long as it's worn, it'll last a while. Okay, I need two worms. By the way, one of the things I read, and speaking of worms, uh, in the new Sakal uh, or Daisy 1.26, um, when you um, go fishing, if you dig for worms, if you use a shovel, you get more worms than if you use yeah, a knife. Yeah, I heard that part. Yeah. That's pretty cool. It makes uh, a little bit of sense. Yeah. Knife got ruined. Oh. But I have two hooks. Craft a fishing braid. Oh. Okay. Definitely dig up some worms just because it's. It's already hard enough to catch fish on this server as it is. I mean, I, I've caught many fish on here without worms, but it takes longer. Uh, well, it, it's it's just random is what it really boils down to. Yeah, yeah. So it's like a the percentage is like you know let's just say it's five percent chance if without a worm and a ten percent chance with wind with with a worm, you've got double the the odds, and so every time it throws a random number. So every time that that circle completes, that's when it draws a random number. Mm -hmm. And you know, if you if you hit the jackpot, so to speak, you know, you got ten percent. Then you win. If you don't, you just keep rolling. Well, look at that. Yeah. I just got two fish back to back. Nice. I went from not catching any fish to catching fish. Been using this, I think this bayonet's about to die. Found a bayonet on a, a Mosin bayonet. Yeah, I got something. But it's going to free up four slots once it dies, so I'm not complaining. A cooking pot. Hey, keep it. We need those, man. It'll, it'll One, it'll protect your gear a bit better. So you put any of your valuables in it. Uh, and if you don't already have a waterproof container, you can... Um, um, you can use it as a waterproof container. Yeah. So you can put your matches inside so they don't get wet in the rain. I've I've got a waterproof container. I've got like a. So I can boil. Wa we can boil water. We both have pots for water. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I've got you some boiled water back up at the at the house. Dude, I just, I've got three fish now. <laughs> I haven't got any. i got a pair of wellies and a cooking pot. Now, I'm going, to get, now I'm going to get a Land Rover. <laughs> <laughs> Holloman's got a Land Rover. And he's putting up his flag today. Or I tonight. meant to message him earlier. He, uh, he was hurt pretty bad, and I was trying to get you guys to slow down, but we were all hurt pretty bad so I was worried he didn't survive last night <clears throat> I gave him like three pieces of venison I think which I think hunger was his main problem but chimney crickets apparently this Okay, now we've got to have a fish here. You got one. Yeah. Okay, well, we have four fish now, so we're, we're good. All right, I'd, so. I'd, 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 I'd recommend we... <laughs> oh, shit, where did that... That hook's no good. I'll leave that. I guess I have to break down this fishing rod, right? 
Yeah, yeah. just to help you out. Yeah. Your space. Yeah, I got the cooking pot. Uh, can I... T oh, I can use the axe to break it down. Okay. Yep. Axe, knife, anything sharp. All right. There we go. So the rope... Finally. ...can go here. That's ruined. Yeah, I'm going to make my way back up to the cabin. Start cutting up this fish and... Uh, I can't bring the welly, so can you? We'll can come I... back and get them. We'll be here. They're not going to go anywhere. And no room for a stick. No. I go ahead and make a knife here before What's I go. In the bag. Hold on. Okay, I'll be back up in the thing. Hopefully, the fire hasn't gone out. It shouldn't have. It's not been long enough, but I've had this feeling for a while that they've done something to the how long logs lost on here. I think they don't last as long as vanilla. I'm getting rid of this Winchester. It's taking up too much space. And only two logs left. Let me cut some more down. Turn into a pretty day. I gotta say, I really, I miss it when it was a lot clearer. The, the, the perpetual fog just, it's depressing. I'm back up on an angle, I think I'm on the right angle. Didn't have to go up too far, so you, if you haven't made it back yet. You might might have been on the trip. Have. Right? No, which pot? My cook the cooking pot that I have, or? Oh no, no, no! Is it got water in it? Yeah. So about. Well, wait, wait. The fish is cooking right now. So. Okay. Let's cook the fish. There's water behind there in the pot. I cooked it and boiled it for you. Let's see if it's cool down. Okay. Yeah. Just make sure you drink out of this one, not the seven. Are you pot. sick or not? Or. No, I boiled it now, so it should be fine. I bo that's why I boiled the water. The water was already clean. I just boiled it so that it would, you know, not get you sick or anything. Oh, shit. It won't let me drink out of the pot. Get your mouth face covering on. Oh, fuck. <laughs> CHF 101. Oh, this game. I don't feel bad. John, John made that mistake one night when he and... Uh, Fatty were playing on uh, um, Deer Isle has fallen. Yeah. And he's like, I can't eat. And Fatty's like, Hey, you're an admin on your own server. You got you got a face covering on. He's like, Oh, that's right. <laughs> you gotta love that, you know, when you're like <sighs> the owner of the server and realize it. Oh shit, I just got. Daisy or CHF by my own server. Config. Okay, let's cut this fish up too. Well, I 
didn't have room for a big pot in my bag. Oh, I have a can opener. How about that? Oh, good. Well, that's good. If we you come across canned food. Was your cooking pot empty? No, mine had 100% water in it, and it's damaged. Yours is badly damaged, so... Yeah, I got the badly one. Okay. No. All right, so I got that in there. I got a couple sticks in there. got my ha another hatchet. One second, though. Did you drink any of the water that was in yep. here? Yeah, yeah. I drink all of it. Oh, really? You can drink it all in one go. You can drink two liters of water on it. That's less than two liters now. Yeah, you can you can you can drink le Oh, you're spilling it out because you're wearing the thing. I take your face covering off. Oh. Good night. Just Reaper. drink. Just keep drinking. Reaper's as long as you haven't eaten anything, your stomach is empty. You can drink two liters of water, which is equivalent to one cooking pot. I'm full now. How many pieces of fish we got there? Well, we got two fish each, so eight total okay. each. I'll Once you got two, that, I'll put pot. two in your pot and two in my pot. Oh no, no, I already got my fish. You, that's all your fish now. I don't oh, okay, all right. I'll go ahead and grab my pot. If we run into bush, maybe he can repair these pots because. Oh, you can't stack the hooks, eh? Nope. Um, that's that's that was when that mod was on the the mod for um, leather making that allowed that. So unfortunately, Doesn't make sense that you can put matches in a cooking pot and not them get wet. Well, so the well, hold on a second. Is your cooking pot empty? No. Oh, well, now they'll be wet. <laughs> uh huh. You got, it's got to. It has to be empty for them to not get wet. It's the, I'm. I'm. I was. Uh, yeah, they're damp now. Just let them sit there. They'll dry. Yummy. There you go. Uh, that's why I was saying that they can act as a waterproof container, but you have to not carry water around. so that I got water for the road. And you washed, right? Yeah, I washed.
Have you boiled the water in your in your pot yet? Uh, not yet. Yeah, you might as well do that, but fill it up all the way so that you do get the full benefit. Right now, it's only like three. Quarters. I think it was only seven. Yeah, three quarters of the way. Should I take? I can leave the bones and stuff in it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be fine. All right, so I got to go down and get some water. You, you can put stuff in it all day and it'd be wet. It'll just get wet or soaked if it's so closed. What kind of an cloth. angle do you take to go down here? Uh, you're on the right angle. And to eat, I guess, has to be probably what, like 60 degrees? 60, yeah, it's just a mollusk. But I think they have their own version of it on here. One thing I didn't notice for a while is you can also uh, like put in your the cooked meat in your hand, and when it stops steaming or smoking, you can eat it. Yeah, I have actually found that when you cook food, if you leave it on a stick, like it it cools down faster. And I even did an experiment where I cooked two pieces of meat. And the second one I cooked cooled down faster than the first one because I left it on the stick. Now, I think when I did it, I was outside, so I don't know if that plays a role. But like I said, the one that I took off the stick was hotter than the one that was left on the stick after a few minutes. So I felt like the stick was acting like some kind of like heat conductor, which sort of kind of makes sense in real life. Um, might even be a vanilla daisy thing for all I know. But anyway, just... Summon down. Keep in mind. Jesus, it might be raining soon here. Just got nice and dry, just in time for more rain. This is what people were complaining about, and it seems like it was not... Oh, what is, what is cooking in there? Boiling. Oh, you have your fish in there, too. No, take your fish out. It'll overcook. Yeah, the water's boiling, though, so it's fine now. But you can boil stuff with it in there, but the food might not appreciate being in there twice or cooked twice. Yeah, yeah. But, you know, people were complaining about the nonstop rain. John fixed it. Things were to the point where it was raining, but not too much, um, or at least not for hours on end but it seems like that has come back and it's like those are the kind of things that I'm like just stop tweaking well, you turned it, it was good that's what he did, probably. Well, yeah and that's probably what he did and it wasn't that it wasn't raining it was just more realistic it was raining then it wouldn't rain for a while then it would rain yeah, now well, it's just like rain, not rain, rain, not rain, rain, not well, rain. It's just Fatty had a good run old. today. I mean, it didn't yeah. it didn't look like it hardly rained at all when he was out. Yeah. It, it might not have, but it's just right now that's sort of kind of what's happening is it seems like it's toggling back and forth. And so I don't know for a fact. I'm just speculating that maybe they've made tweaks. But it's, it sort of kind of goes to what you and I were talking about is, is that sometimes, you know, I felt like CHF has hit perfection a number of times. Oh, like my where bones were got just... ruined. What? My bones in the pot got ruined. Why, why are you still boiling the water? The water's boiled, man. The water was boiled like the moment they started bubbling. Oh. I thought you had to wait for a while. No, no. Once you hear the bubbles, it's it's at 100 degrees Celsius. Now, how does a boiling water ruin a small stone? That doesn't make any sense. That could be a daisy thing. I'm just going to go ahead and burn these. That sucks. Put the fish in here. Oh, shit. I'm moving this, the small sticks in there because we're about to lose that fire. You're lucky you didn't lose the fish, but I think the fish didn't get lost because they're a type of food. So I wonder if they could have gotten burned. Could you imagine that? Burned fish. Oh, look. It's going to rain. Uh, burned fish inside the <laughs> boiling water. The hell? No. Well, I didn't lose all my bones because I have. Oh, I got one left. Well, I got bones red. I've got bones, and oh, um, they're worn. Is but it getting dark again? Yeah, it's rain. That's what I was saying. It's a storm coming, I think. Well, what do you do when it's a storm? You stay in the house. Yeah. Our stories around the campfire. 
Let me go outside and cut some uh, sticks. Cut some wood. Some yeah, some sticks while before we get soaked again. But I mean, look at that. Just enough time to dry off, and then and another then we have storm. To go back in the rain. That's. It's that was what was happening months ago. Yeah. The worst of it was months ago. It would rain for like an hour, and then it would clear oh. up for just ten minutes. Oh. At least you know now it's not raining for that long, but it's just as bad if every two kilometers you got to spend an hour drying off. You well, know. Well, you've got to make it believable. It's got to be believable. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I know exactly. I what mean, you're saying. you know. No, you don't Hold know. on. Yeah, I gotta get more wood. Oh shit! Blinded by the lightning. Shit! You got lightning. But and that's what I'm. I'm not complaining. You know, it's just. I mean, I am. I guess, obviously. But it's just. Oh god! If what you're gonna have is like every. Um. You're going to have 20 minutes of rain, then 10 minutes of not rain, or 20 minutes of... If it's 20 minutes on, 20 minutes off, and back and forth all the time, it's just... That's not fun. I mean, ideally what you would have is... It would be just like a real world, right? Yeah. You get two or three days where it doesn't rain, and then maybe one day where it rains the entire day. Now, this is a game. You don't want to be... You don't want your players to be stuck inside a house... For three hours because that's a day so you, you do want to break it up yeah but how many players would do that in the first place i mean you're going to lose players you're trying to build uh, no a, no you're yeah. trying to build a player base aren't you yeah yeah i'm and not this, i'm not arguing for that what i'm saying is you want to have some kind of balance between reality and the fact that in the real world when it does rain sometimes you get a rainy day where it rains the entire day right and when you do have a rainy day well, on this server, that would translate to two-hour rainstorm. You don't necessarily want that because you don't want people stuck indoors for two hours. No. So you want some kind of balance, something between reality and not reality. And I would say that's like you just have a weather forecast that pops up the storm. Um, and maybe the longest rainstorm you can have is 40 minutes. Um, and you can go for as much as two days without rain, right? Um, so that, that makes up for the fact that you don't have the very long rain showers. I and thought I you were up behind the house. No, no. I was just looking for wood. So you just want some kind of balance, right? Where it, it rains, maybe 20, 30 minutes at most, sometimes as little as 10 or 15, and then maybe you don't have a rainstorm for a couple hours. You know, Shit, you so don't want to have... be out in this stuff, do you? No, 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 no. I and mean, right now, because the lightning blinds you, and it takes away your vision, you know, which, you know, I, I'm outside all the time during a storm, and lightning doesn't blind me. You know, it's just bright. But I guess what I'm trying to say is, is that because you want this balance between realism and a game that people will play, you, you don't want somebody being stuck indoors for no. a day. no. You would probably try to create a rule and say, not a rule that players follow, but a rule for your for your weather mod. The weather would be set so that it could never rain for more than five thirty minutes of actual game time. Uh, and the way you make up for that is is that you have rainy days where you might have on and off rain, but then you won't have rain for maybe two days. Uh, well, it's and then the you middle have rain of summer. Again. It shouldn't be raining anyway. Uh, you know, depends. But yeah, this is supposed to basically be Ukraine. Um, yeah, you want to mix. They have summer. Uh, oh, they get yeah, they the have summer. summer. They have droughts. They have. So you're right. I mean, there there should not be. There should be periods where there isn't rain. But right now it's summer and we're still cold. Yeah. And I haven't really asked in the chat. Yeah. I st after you know just it's been a while since I've asked in Discord, but I've been wondering. I mean, we're in August. Are we gonna have summer? You know, is it gonna get hot? No. Yeah. you know, and, and, but with one two six coming. Apparently things yeah. are changing. Yeah. When do they have a date for 1.26? Have you heard I anything yet? Heard, no. No. I, I've heard that it's probably going to be October, November, and Sakal is probably going to be released after it. So, but oh. probably before Christmas. So, 
it might be that 1.26 comes out in October, November, and the map follows like a month later. And but I, I was right. You know, they're going to do what they did with Livonia. All the assets will be in the base game, so everybody gets them, and you're basically just paying for the map, just like with Livonia. When Livonia came out, you forked an extra, I don't know, was it 20 bucks, 15 bucks? Yeah. And you got a copy of Livonia. Um, but everybody who owned the game had the assets, so when uh, John McClane created all, you know, Deer Isle and all the other maps, um, and he used the Livonia assets on his maps, it, you didn't have to own Livonia to see them. And so we will get that with call. So all the new houses, all the new grass textures, all the new game features should be in the vanilla game. And Sakal will just be a map using all those features. Which is good because it means that Winter Chinaris once... Because Lad, Lad is now working for Bohemia, but once Lad has a chance, he can convert Winter Chinaris to use all those assets. Which will be good. The snow will look better. Well, come November, the snow should start to fall and the weather yeah. should get a little different. Yeah. More snowstorms, but not all day. Yeah. I just want DayZ 2.0 to come out in the next two or three years because so I've seen what Reforger can do. And I know that you know, you're like, oh, I don't, I'm not going to play Reforger. But oh, there's a lot of people playing DayZ Reforger. Um, and I think you'd like it. You know, well, I it, might you know, play maybe. Reforger, but how much is it to buy? Well, right now it's not on sale, but it, it was on sale during the summer sale. Um, but it goes on sale. It's even fun to play as a stand. I mean, I, I play Reforger, uh, standalone, uh, standalone, yeah, the, the game by itself online. And, uh, you know, you may have seen Gecko play it. It's a lot of fun. Squad based. You could probably have a lot of get, you know, get a lot of laughs out of it. We could go in a squad, go kill the enemy and, you know, I saw just have playing some it. adventures. Yeah. Copa plays it. I haven't him played it for a while, but I saw him. Then you got um, DayZ Reforger, which just puts a mod, which is exactly how the original DayZ was, a mod for Arma 2. Um, and, I mean, just, when you've seen the world that's rendered in Reforger, this is still really, really nice, don't get me wrong. And I like I like the skyboxes in a way because the clouds are still a work in progress in Reforger. But it's... Um, there's some things like the lighting effects are so much better in Reforger. Like when you see somebody far away with a light, I mean it. It's just night and day with with Daisy, or with yeah, with Daisy. So we made it out of the cave. We took what 300 steps and we're stuck in complete utter darkness and rain. Completely soaked, made it here at the crack of dawn, dried off, went fishing, had a bath. caught fish, cooked the fish, had a bath, and it's Not already raining rain again. So feels like it was 20 minutes of rain, 20 minutes off. And oh, so God. if we can make it, if we keep up the pace when the storm goes by, then we might be able to make it to Three Gorges in short order. But right now, this shit's holding us up. And this that's the thing I'm talking about. It's like, you want realism, you, you want those rainy days, but you don't want to actually do that in this game because when you do, you get people stuck in a cabin like this, you know? And that's... Well, smart players aren't going to go out and run around. No. They get soaked. Yeah, exactly. But we're going to be in here. We're going to stay dry. Get sick and... Yeah. And I mean, there's, there's an aspect to this game where, you know, what would you do in real life? You would sit around the fire and you'd talk, and that's what we're doing right now. Yeah. Talking about... <laughs> the next version of this game you know but at the same time i don't you know i'd like to be out there playing you know yeah so that, that's that's that that mix and that's like on my own hardcore server which is still like a work in progress like right now it's just basically single player because it's on my land i've got many of the same mods um from that russian guy the ones like ripping the bandages yeah or ripping the rags and the, the fire being hard to start, you know, taking longer, and 
a dig for bark. All that's by this Russian guy. I think is uh, DR or DR something or other. I don't know. And um, I'll, I'll tell you real quick. I, the names of the mods. If you're not like coding or anything, and like you're just using packs off Workshop, is it pretty easy to set up? Oh yeah, yeah. I've I've created many, many. Like I have in my missions folder on my server. I have like thirty something folders. So I've I've created like a Deer Isle server, and I just mess around. I mean, a lot of time I've written some scripts. Like anytime I connect to a server, I just copy the mod list. And um, I'll play around with the mod just to see what they can do, you know. If I see a mod I like, I might grab it and put it on my server. So my, my current, you know, you know, um, the end server, I haven't really come up with a name for it, but it's the really hardcore one, has probably got 70% of the mods from here that are third party. Mm -hmm. So like... Um, it doesn't obviously have CHF1, CHF2, CHF3. Those are server-specific. But it's got, like, the sleep mod, so the mod for sleep. Um, it's got the zombie mod. It's got a lot of the mods for um, uh, some of the mechanics, like the digging for bark and whatnot. But I've also got a lot of the same... Um, custom areas like there's a I forget that I think the mod is called like apocalyptic churneros or something like that mm. and it's the thing that adds a lot of the clutter to some of these locations there's like two mods uh, I'd have to go look at my mod list to tell you the names of them but like like when you go into uh, Berezino there's like a giant apartment complex now on the ocean front and for the longest time, I thought that was something that John had created, but no, it's actually um, a third-party mod, part of this, you know, a a a Apocalypse uh, Cherno that modifies, like, a dozen or two cities. Um, and the only reason I found out was I was looking at CHF1 on the workshop, and John has a list of all the mods that are included. And I'm like, what's this Apocalypse Cherno? And I was like, oh, this is that mod. And then there's another mod... And I forget the name of this one, but it takes a lot of the smaller towns and makes them look worn down. So the two mods alone add a lot of the custom areas on here. Um, then a lot of the caves that are on here are off off the workshop. Um, so a lot of the stuff I've been able to pull, you know, and and tweak myself. Like some of the caves are not on here. Like I've traveled to the various locations and not found a cave. Um, but, like, on my own server, I have 23 caves now. Because I like the mm -hmm. caves. They're really... They, I think they add an element. They're very well... The ones that I've kept are very well integrated, and I've even made um, my own cave that I'm sort of kind of still tweaking. So... Um, but just playing, playing on a lot of other servers, I'll come across a mod and go, oh, this is a cool mod. I'm going to add it. Like... When we were on Nuts Gone Rusty, he used a mod called, um, I forget the mod name, but you'd, you'd made furniture out of, out of, um, um, pallets. Oh, and yeah, yeah, yeah. We did. Yeah, that, yeah, that was a lot of fun. And when you think about it, there's tons of pallets in this game. And so that felt like a really natural m mod to put, you know, it makes the furniture look really basic. Yeah. You can make those storage boxes. Remember the storage yeah, boxes yeah, you yeah, can yeah. make? Boomlay, that's what it was. I just Boomlays. remember. Yeah. Well, but like, I'll they, tell you, they, like... Yeah, he took them out for some reason, didn't he? They I don't know. In, or was it... He yeah. might have. I can't remember what's going on. That's gone rusty. Yeah. Well, this is not going uh, very well. It's okay. You win some, you lose some. Holloman's so. in the chat. Is he? Why don't you have a clubhouse on CHF yet? Well, the quiet, the answer to that question is we haven't had time. That's a big part of it. Okay, I've got all the mods open what here. What's going on? on? We're waiting for a lightning storm to go by.
Here it is. It's called Trinarus Exile Overhaul. Oh. And it's the one that adds all the custom areas that you see, like, in Berezino and stuff. And then there's another one called Apocalyptic City Trinarus that's on CHF. And it modifies Kamenka, Kamarovo, Baloda, Electro, Kamishovo, Three Valleys, Solnichny, Factory, Solny, Niznai, Berezino, Svetlyarsk, Turovo, Pusta, Tuga, Mista, Pavlovo, Pavlovo Base, Orvlets, Dolina, Gorka, Stary Sobor, and Polano. So all those cities get modded. And if you look at this mod on the workshop, I mean, literally, like, when I started playing here three years ago, this was, like, I don't know, 75% of the custom areas. But in all that time, John has now probably created double the number of custom areas that he's done on his own. So he definitely does a lot of map modding. So the number of custom areas on CHF now is probably, like, I don't know, probably, if you don't include all those third-party mods, like Apocalyptic Cherno and all this that stuff, he probably has, like, 100 to 150 of his own custom areas. I mean, I'm, I'm just pulling a number out of my ass. Yeah. I don't know for sure, but it just feels like... I mean, I, I know it's Apocalyptic Cherno's, uh and the other one, the... the Chinarus Exile Overhaul. Mm -hmm. uh, and then there's also some of the caves. Um, but there's so many other areas too. I know like the there's another one called the uh, let's see, the Berez Bereski Bereziki military bunker. Oh yeah, right? oh that one. That yeah. place? That's a mod. It's made yeah. by a guy called uh Doosty. Um yeah. So it's I've seen that on other servers. Before. We went in there to rescue a hobo one time. Me yeah. and the tentacle. Well, the the bunker too here. The bunker, the bunker six six six, up in um, in Tizzy. That's a mod. Um, and so is the bunker that's up in uh, Kamensk. It's the same mod that they're running on Red Tick. Nice. So if if you go if you go to CHF if you go to CH Fallen One on the workshop. You'll see that there's there's probably 70 mods listed here, and the ones towards the bottom are all the mods that are custom areas. But like I said, since CHF was created, John has created a ton of his own. So, um, but what was the other mod we were just talking about? You asked me about the. The cutting up the rags. Let me see if there's a rag. rag. Air rags. Here we go. DZR. That's the guy. So his name is Mikhail. And all his mods are DZR this, DZR that. And he's got a lot of them. But he's got... He's the one that created the bicycle that that crackpot used to have the one that you took the tire box tire repair kit and it turned into a bicycle remember that oh yeah yeah the bicycle uh, one. He, he's got that mod it's not really a survival mod but um he's got let's see he's he, he's the one that dzr tie door right so tie door is the thing that allows you to take wire or rags to lock a door. So that's DZR as well. Um, and then you've got... Let's see. Disinfect by boiling is DZR. Shoulder rifles only. DZR, I don't think we use that one. Or we, the CHF uses that one. Combat log detection. DZR notes. Relieving notes. Here's one that I thought was interesting that I put on my oh, server. Oh, shit, you left the door open. No wonder it's getting cold in here. Called DZR Smell Z. So this one, you can actually smell people and oh, things going on. Look at the weather. So ima imagine we're, we're hiking along and we say, and you see on the screen... You smell barbecue in the distance, you know, coming from the west. We could use that to hunt down other players, right? Yeah. 
He's also got another mod called DZR Hardcore Tweaks. And this one is the one that does... Um, um, this is the one that um, allows you to find bark on the ground, Hold where it includes yeah. it. Yeah, it also has um, longer digging. So the digging mod, the thing that takes longer to dig, is from DZR. And the longer fire start. And if you read his mod, he says, compensates the ability to find bark by making hand drill start fire for 2 minutes and 20 seconds with matches. So it's a 2 minute, 20 second operation. With matches? With, uh, oh no, yeah, 2 minutes without 20 seconds with matches. So right. matches take 20 seconds. Now, it's a mod. They can open up the PBO and change those times if they want to, but... Roger that. Good lord, is this is this gonna ever end? You know, rags by hand is another one. But yeah, just look up DZR on the on the workshop. I I already like I said, I put a lot of his mods on my server. Those are free but to yeah, use, are they? Or? Yeah, yeah. These are these are all open source. Anybody can use them. You can't repack most of them, but I've become a big proponent against pack repackaging because it's just a lot of a lot of modders call it the cancer of Daisy, and I sort of kind of see that. I mean, it does mean that if you got a lot of mods, your mod list is going to be long. But when you repack, you, the server owner, has to remember to go out and look for new versions of the mod. And if you don't, you know, it just it causes problems. So repackaging is not a good thing. But um, But Strucky, you were talking about coding and whatnot. I, I, I've been messing around a bit with it and trying to pick up, you know, it's not so much how it works. The, the syntax of the language is very much, it's very similar to C++ and C Sharp, which I use on a daily basis for my, my day job. Mm -hmm. The problem is the, what we call the API, the application programmer interface, the framework, all the functions that you can call. Well, the things that you can do and learning those, those aren't really well documented. And so you have to learn by example. And that's how I do my job anyway. If I want to learn how to do something, I Google it and I look on a, often on a website called Stack Overflow and that'll tell you how to do something. You don't really have that for Daisy. There's a couple of uh, f um, forums that you can, you know, jump into where people talk about this kind of stuff. You have a telegram from uh, Holloman. Holloman? I have a telegram from Holloman. Hold on a second. Probably a couple. Oh, oh, I got two holograms of all of it. Okay. Okay. Right. I got it. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna stop raining. I have no idea. It almost seems like it is. It's waiting for us to come out there and get wet. Then it'll stop, and then we have to find another place to have a fire. I'm going back out into the rain to get another fish. Where are you at, anyway? I'm like, like I'm in the middle of nowhere, in between like Krasno, Gavzdino, and Svergino. Like I'm out in the woods. What near Austria? The military. Uh? By Austrian military, the one we were in. Yeah, the I other went. Day? I did go there. Yeah. And then I went like more towards Nobilug through all the woods. Okay, because we're we're tr we're going to try and make it over to the pub. Yeah. But that isn't happening tonight. So. If you want to leave yourself in position to... Yeah, I'm probably done sooner since it's raining and stuff yeah. still. So. I'm, I'm, I'm well, about ready to call this. Here's, so we could, Red, yeah. uh, I, I've got some, some news. We could uh, we could log off here yeah. in a minute. And this is, the, this is the thing that makes me sad. I love this server, but stuff like this happens and you're just spending an hour in a cabin. It just, it's not... Well, it's already been more than a half hour and I, I'm done. Yeah. I know. And uh, we can resume this some other time. Yeah. 
I mean, for me, it's I'm not streaming, so I don't mind waiting. But it's not cool for chat and no. everybody else to be stuck in a place like this. So that's like there was but, ten or more people it. there, and they, now they've all left. They've all left. Yeah, see, well, exactly. Half of them did anyway. And that's so that just doesn't. It's not. It's not conducive to a streamer to stick around on server. So, like I said, I don't mind sticking around, but you know, if you wanted to get off stream, um, it's also easier when you're just one person, because you know, if I were to go out and get wet, uh, at least I don't have to worry about you know you getting lost or us getting separated or something like that. You know, if because if, right now the storm is so heavy that I mean, just look outside; you can barely see anything. It'd be easy to get separated yeah. out there. So, okay. All right, well, I'm but I've got on. I've got some I've got some intel. Okay, we'll talk but about maybe, it later. Yeah, well, maybe what we, we can do is actually just go ahead and log off out of here. You can end the stream, and then we can act on this intel. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. So we're going to do that. Chat. Thanks everybody for hanging around. Uh, yeah. I'm on. just glad we came back here because I mean, like I said, I've been playing a couple times a week, but I hope that. At least once a week, you and Minnow can come here and, yeah. you know, Strucky and, and Gin, or Reaper. Yeah. Also, it'd be nice to have a group over here. Yeah. Sure. Okay, boys. Yeah. We'll see, see you, you all next Wednesday. time. Have a good night. It's already quarter to one. No, 1230. Late enough. Okay.